Number 5. Eufy 11S the RoboVac 11S looks very similar to the original RoboVac 11. Its circular body is darker in colour, which makes the UV logo at the bottom slightly less noticeable. It's also smaller, measuring 12.8 inches in diameter and 2.8 inches tall, compared with the original's 13 inch diameter and 3 inch height. That makes the RoboVac 11S the shortest robot vacuum we've tested, and perfect for getting under especially low coffee tables, couches and media consoles. The included remote is oblong in shape and has a monochrome display at the top. The left side of the screen tells you the current cleaning mode, while the right side is divided into thirds. The top tells you the time, the middle indicates suction power, and the bottom shows you when your cleaning schedule is set. The buttons below are all labelled with icons, while a key on the opposite side provides a more detailed explanation of what they do. Unfortunately, you can't customise schedules for the 11S like you can with many other robots. For example, you can't have it clean at one time on Monday and Wednesday and a different time Tuesday and Friday. Once you set a time, it'll clean at the same time every day. The RoboVac 11S busts dust just as well as robot vacuums that cost twice as much. In testing, it easily picked up a full bin of dirt, hair and plenty of other odds and ends from the floor of PC Labs. It also has a Boost IQ suction mode that automatically increases cleaning strength on carpeted floors. I found this feature worked reliably in testing and eliminates the need to manually change suction modes during cleaning sessions. The 11S is also good at manoeuvring across different types of flooring, it easily managed transitions between carpet and vinyl and had no problems with raised edges. And while no vacuum is truly silent, the 11S is as quiet as they come. It's barely noticeable when you're in the same room, and if you have the TV on or music playing, you probably won't hear it at all. Its small form factor, powerful suction, quiet operation and solid battery life make it a no-brainer for anyone with lots of low-profile furniture. Number 4. Roborock S5 Max Design-wise, the Roborock S5 Max doesn't deviate too much from other models in the range. A round and slim cleaner, 350x350x97mm, the S5 Max will happily slide under a lot of sofas, although it may struggle to manoeuvre between some dining chair legs. The S5 Max comes in available in white or black, but both options look really good, finished in a high-quality gloss plastic. This model certainly looks and feels like a premium one. Open the top of the lid and you get access to the 0.46 litre bin, which easily lifts out for emptying. There's a handy brush and razor in this compartment too, designed to cut away hair from the roller brush underneath. This roller brush is easily removed for cleaning. Since the microfiber cloth will be wet when the clean is complete, Roborock ships the S5 Max with a plastic floor protector that sticks down around the small charging dock. This is particularly handy if you have wooden floors, as you don't want to leave something wet sitting on them. Although you can start and stop a clean using the buttons found on top of the robot, full control comes courtesy of the RoboRock app. This quickly takes you through connecting the robot to your home network, and it only took a few minutes. The first clean is where the S5 Max will map out your home. Once done, you can save the details. Mapping allows you to zone your home, splitting it into rooms, and effectively giving you the option of cleaning only one area. Beyond cleaning a room or everywhere, you can also mark one-off cleaning zones, drawing a box around the area you want to clean, and setting how many passes you'd like the robot to make. It's a handy way of cleaning up a specific mess, say just the area immediately around where you are cooking. Scheduling lets you set which areas to clean and the mode to use, so you can keep your home clean automatically. Roborock's Robot Vacuum Mop Hybrid gets better with each new version. Thoughtful feature upgrades and performance improvements make the S5 Max the best yet. Number 3. Neato D6 Neato currently offers five models in its BotVac Connected series, and while the $699 BotVac D6 Connected is far from the cheapest, it's the most affordable robot vacuum with the ability to remember and store more than one floor plan via multi-storey mapping. It also features virtual boundaries, works with a well-designed app, and offers voice assistant compatibility with Amazon Alexa and Google Assistant, in addition to good suction and excellent battery life. The D6 looks like all the other vacuums in the BotVac Connected series. Like its mid-range sibling, the D4 Connected, the D6 has an all-black body but opts for a simple brushed finish up top as opposed to the D4's textured pattern. The bottom of the D6 is home to a wide roller brush, two treads, and a tiny spin brush. In the box, you get a decent number of accessories, including the charging dock and power cord, another spiral combo brush, a spider brush, a filter, a cleaning tool, and magnetic boundary tape. Enabling voice assistant commands is also a breeze. 
All you have to do is go into the individual Amazon Alexa and Google Home apps, enable the Neato skill and link your accounts. Once that's done, you can do things like ask Alexa or Google Assistant to start and stop vacuuming, return the T6 to its dock and check on battery levels. The mobile app is well designed and simple to navigate. From the main screen, you can view battery life, start vacuuming, toggle cleaning options and view cleaning maps and history. The Neato Robotics Companion app is particularly well designed. You can start, stop and pause cleanings from the main screen as well as send the vacuum pack to its dock. You can also select the type of cleaning you want done. The house option enables a full automatic cleaning in one of two modes, Eco, a quieter but longer cleaning, and Turbo, which provides more powerful and louder suction. The Spot option performs a concentrated cleaning of a specific area. The Botvac D6 Connected did a great job vacuuming all kinds of debris from the low-pile carpet, hardwood and linoleum in our tests. It's questionable that it's any more prodigious at vacuuming animal hair and dander than the D7, but all else being equal, the D6's slightly less intimidating list price would seem to make it the more attractive option for pet and petless households alike. Number 2. Neato D7 the Neato Bot Vac D7 Connected is smarter than your average robot vacuum. In addition to laser navigation, it features interactive cleaning maps, a simple and intuitive app, and class leading integration with third party smart home devices and services. The D7 bears a strong resemblance to the other vacuums in the Bot Vac Connected line, with Neato's signature D shape for getting into tight spaces. The main physical difference from the D5 is that it sports a new metallic finish that's more resistant to dust and scratches. It also has four LED indicator buttons, two more than the previous models, that help provide better feedback during cleaning sessions. You can view battery level, Wi-Fi status and cleaning modes. As far as accessories go, the D7 comes with a charging dock as well as your typical assortment of spare brushes, filters and a cleaning tool. It also comes with a 2 meter magnetic strip that acts as a physical boundary marker. You probably won't need it as you can set boundaries in the app, which I'll detail in the next section. Setting up the D7 is relatively easy. You don't have to physically attach any parts or brushes as it comes pre-assembled. All you have to do is download the Neato app for Android or iOS. From there, you'll be guided through the process of pairing the vacuum with your Wi-Fi network and it supports both 2.4 GHz and 5 GHz Wi-Fi. You can also opt for extra care navigation, which is gentler than the default mode. For spot mode, you can designate a specified cleaning radius. In home mode, the D7 navigated back and forth in a methodical manner across my apartment while easily maneuvering around obstacles. It handled different surfaces such as wood, carpet and tile with no trouble. It was also able to reliably dock on its own, something infrared-based vacuums often struggle with. If it ever gets stuck, you can use your phone to steer it, which is a feature the Roomba 960 doesn't support. Neato's Botvac D7 Connected offers interactive cleaning maps, long battery life and better third-party smart home integration than any other robot vacuum. Number 1. iRobot Roomba i7 Plus the iRobot Roomba i7 Plus is an impressive new development for iRobot's line of robot vacuums and a logical next step for the product category. Between its new smart mapping tech and digital assistant integration, this is well worth the money if you can swing the steep price. The Roomba is all but a cultural touchstone now, an emblem of automation and a sort of next age for the home appliance. To think that this was built upon a thing that you still had to empty and clean out every single time. The Roomba i7 Plus looks an awful lot like its predecessors at first glance, but contains so many more differences once you flip the machine upside down. Before getting into that, one thing about the vacuum shell that's markedly different here is that the new LED now blinks and shines different colours depending on its current state. Once you flip the vacuum over, you'll immediately notice some improvements to the rubber rollers that pull in dirt, as there are now more and more refined grooves for better pickup. Also, the dustbin that's attached to the vacuum has been improved, both for easier emptying manually and automatically. From there, you can tell Roomba to clean specific rooms in your space after you've designated those spaces using the iRobot app. However, beware that if you ever change or reset your Wi-Fi network, chances are that you'll have to act out this process all over again. This is at least in our experience, and it's ultimately a minor inconvenience, but an inconvenience nonetheless. The iRobot Roomba i7 Plus is an impressive new development for iRobot's line of robot vacuums and a logical next step for the product category. Roomba was already enough for us to leave sweeping and vacuuming ourselves in the dust, but now it's practically irresistible. Buying Guide Firstly, size. 
Consider how big your house is before you start browsing the Amazon aisles. Some robot vacuums like the iLife V3S Pro work better in smaller environments like apartments and townhomes, while models like the iRobot Roomba S9 are better suited for spaces of up to 2,000 square feet with multiple rooms and multiple floors. Your pick will mainly depend on the size of your dwelling. You'll also want to figure out how much room you have under the furniture for the robot vacuum to pass through. Secondly, battery life. Here's the thing about battery life on a robot vacuum, it only matters to some extent. Most of the robot vacuums we tested lasted throughout an entire cleaning session without needing a charge. On average, a robot vacuum can clean for up to an hour and a half, with some high-end models lasting a full two hours. Some vacuums will even navigate back to their base stations, charge up, and then finish cleaning to get the deed done. And thirdly, price. Robot vacuums are available in all sorts of shapes and sizes and at varying prices. As with most things in life, the more you spend, the more features you get. For example, higher-end robot vacuums will have better mapping capabilities, which means they can clean your house more quickly. However, we found robot vacuums less than $200 that clean just as well, if not better, than models that cost three to four times as much.